many times we want to use engineering models in our presentation. And the uh, production of the equations can be challenging if you're not familiar with some of the equation editors available to you. And one that I want to show you is using Microsoft Equation 3.0 that's available to you in any of the Office products. To get to that in PowerPoint, you would click on the Insert button and then click on Object and uh, wait a moment and then we will get a menu that we can choose the editor and I'm going to scroll down till I find Microsoft Equation 3.0 and click OK. So with this we can utilize the menus that will allow us to develop professionally looking equations. So for instance if I wanted to put in the equation for Antoine's equation for instance we know that the base 10 logarithm of the vapor pressure so we would type in log and now I want a subscript for the 10 so I will select the subscript template and click on the one that just has a subscript and type 10 and then hit the right arrow to get out of the subscript and then put in P star and that will equal the coefficient A minus now if you recall the we have a fraction that we have to use so we can select a fraction template and put in B over T plus C and with a little practice you can go through the various menus for summations and integrals and the like and when you're done you just click update and then click exit to return to presentation and here's your equation and you can stretch a little bit to make it larger and your equation is now written and this makes it very easy to see how the equations developed and make the reader a little more informed as to your intentions.